welcome back everyone, Grojan here, and today we're going to have a look at a game called The Stalked. Now, as usual, knowing nothing about any of this game, so we're just going to go straight in and start it, and see what it comes up as. It was another one of the games I googled for shortish horror games, and it says it's about 40 minutes long, so we, we're just going to do this in one go, and see how we get on. And it starts off, I had to break up with Liam, and I hope he takes it well. Okay, so we are just in a little tiny room, got a front door behind us, we can't get out of it. This door opens right in our face. Right. <laughs> Looks kind of bright. I mean, it doesn't look like a horror, horror type game from what we can see so far. Now, what have we got to do? It sounds like we're hungry. We need to make some food. I'm hungry. What can we eat? Oh, there's a pan. We can get a pan. Stick it on the, the cooker. Turn the gas on. Well, I'm not seeing no flames. <laughs> not seeing no flames. Right, I'm guessing we're going to have to get some food out the fridge. Right, what are we going to eat? What is that? What is that? Organic food. Right, well, we just stick it in the pan. I mean, it looks all right. It looks okay. Let's shut the fridge before something starts going back. Who'd be knocking on my door at this hour? Right, where's our front door? Was that the door? That was the door we came in, wasn't it? What's this? Oh, wow, look at the size of that bathroom. Who's there? Press space to continue. Liam. Hey, honey, can I come in? Uh, Liam, I told you it's over. No, you can't come in. Come on, can you, you can't just leave me like that. I love you more than anything. It's over, Liam. Just go home. Oh, open the door, Kate. He's banging on the door. And no, I'm not opening the door. I don't love you anymore, Liam. You'll be mine again soon. Oh, he's going to be the stalker, isn't he? He's going to be the stalker. So we're not opening the door. Sounds like he walked away, thank God. Let's go and see if our food's ready. Not yet. We can turn the gas off. Food should be ready now. It looks like a soup and she's crunching away. <laughs> Do we have a mirror? I want to know what we look like. A bath to calm myself down a bit would be great right now. Okay. Go and get in the bath. Look at that. She hasn't got a single mirror in the bathroom. How weird is that? What was that? What was that? Someone's just smashed a window. Where is it though? Is it? It's, we didn't have any windows on the front door. None around there. Oh, the bedroom window is gone. Give me another chance, please. I'll treat you well and do anything you want. I promise. Just one chance is all I ask. That can't be too much, can it? Liam. Can we see anything outside? Oh, wow. How far has he just threw that rock? <laughs> He's through, I see, if he's through that from the street, he's a hell of a shot. Even if he's through from that other rooftop over there. Right, let's go in. Can we shut the door again? Oh, we've only got one left. Okay, it is what it is. Uh oh. Oh. Ah. Oh, shit. <laughs> I grab myself then. Oh, you got caught. Try again. We got caught. Oh, so we can't get caught. Run, 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 run. I think we got out. I think we got out. How creepy is that? How did he get in? Hey, what's this? We got our phone. Calling Grandpa. How did he throw the rock through the window and then get back in? Hello, Grandpa. I need your help. Hey, Kate, what's going on? Liam broke into my apartment and chased me. I barely got away and now I'm in my car and I've got nowhere to go. That's horrible. Are you okay? Did he hurt you or something? No, I got away before he could do something, but I'm terrified he'll find me. Okay, I assume you're looking for a place to stay for a while? Yes. You can come and live, you can come and live with me for as long as you want. However, I'm going to be on a business trip for a week. That's fine. I'm still going to be safer than staying here. Can I go there right now? Yes, I'll send you the address. The key to my house is in a flower pot. I'll send you the address. Doesn't she know where her granddad lives? <laughs> also, remember to keep the doors locked. And if you need to go outside, you can always check the people first. Okay, thanks again, Grandpa. You're a lifesaver. No problem. I hope it goes well. And don't hesitate to call me again. Right. Was <laughs> <laughs> go, go, go. I don't know. I'm not controlling it. I'm not controlling it. Run him over. Heartbeat, the heartbeat. I bet he's in the car with us. <laughs> he's like a ghost. 
Also, ich glaube, es geht. Dann geht er mehr wieder raus. <lacht> es geht der Krab, Arby. Leo Mombi, also fahren wir nicht mehr. We hope. We hope. A family broken free from Matt's toxic relationship. Okay, we are driving through a forest. Oh, there's a car behind us. Oh no, did Liam manage to follow me here? That's send off, it's send off. I'm getting too paranoid, paranoid now. Of course it's not him. Probably just a neighbor. Wow, look at the size of this house. This isn't what I expected this game to be like. Not at all. I mean, being called the stork kind of makes sense. Hey, right, we got a flashlight. Our flashlight's our phone. <laughs> right, we need to find the key in the flower pot. Is it this one? It is. It is. We got the keys to the front door. Right, we can actually. Oh, it's dark in here. Let's turn on some lights and find the bedroom. I want to hit the bed as soon as possible. Oh, I should go. <laughs> nice. Do that. We've locked the door. There's a light. Right, we can look through the peephole. Hey. Okay. Find the bedroom. Find the bedroom. Uh, we can probably turn our torch off now, but let's go and turn all the light. Oh, that's not a light. We can probably turn. That's a plug as well. Oh, well, these rooms aren't creepy, right? I don't want to. I don't need to turn the lights on to all the rooms. Just the rooms I'm going to go in, I think. So we're going to go upstairs. There's another light switch. Hey, we can see. We can see. Right, there's our bedroom. Is this the one we want? It says find the bedroom, right? But it doesn't seem to be that bedroom. No more doors this way. Isn't that weird the way the hallway ends like that? It's got to be this one then. Got to be this one. No, that's not a bedroom. We must have been in the right one. <laughs> oh, we left the lights on. Right, that's got to be it. That's got to be it. We can't lock that door, though. Okay. Oh, we can just click on the bed and get some sleep. Right. Tomorrow's going to be a better day, right? Tomorrow's going to be a better day. Okay, we're up. Fish. Eyes are opening. 3.55 in the morning. Wow, I slept that long. I mean, I slept that long. It's the middle of the night. <laughs> it's probably still dark out. Oh, no, it's light. The clock doesn't work. Is Grandpa home already? Uh oh. Check the door. Did someone knock? I thought it was just our footsteps. I don't know. We're going to look through the peephole anyway. No, no one's home. I, I want to go around the back and have a look, but I don't want to get caught. I don't want to get caught. I've got goosebumps. <laughs> it's still saying check the door, right? But we've checked them all. Unless it means this door. Okay, well, we're going to go down into the basement. What's that say? Do not open. Okay, well, we won't open you. I can hear something. I can hear something. It sounded like... It sounded like someone was walking around. Okay, let's just get back down there. I don't know whether we missed something then. Can you hear that? Oh, it's some buzzing. It's the light. Never mind. We're going to go back up anyway. It's still saying to check the door. But we did. Oh, we didn't lock the door behind us, did we? He could have gone in. We left it wide open. This is bad. <laughs> right, let's lock it. Let's lock it. So it's still showing. Check the door, right? Which we did. Unless we can go out to the car, I guess. Oh, there's a letter. <gasps> Here is new residents of this mansion. I'm the previous owner of this mansion, and you're the person I've been looking for. I hope to see you stick around for a while. I'm sure we'll get along just fine. 
I'll be watching you. Oh, I've got another stalker. Watch me, it's a strange to say the least. I need to get going to the store before it gets dark though. Let's be careful. Go to the store. Lock the door. Double check. Make sure it's definitely locked. And go and get in the car. We're keeping an eye out for creepy cars following us and stuff, right? Okay. We seem to be at the store. Looks like it's starting to go a little bit dusk already. It is one guy. What's that? Some kind of paper? Okay, we'll go and check the paper. <laughs> I don't know why they're going to go and check rubbish on the floor. But we will. We will. Missing person. Wow, it's creepy how, looks, how similar she looks to me. Ashley missing. Please help us bring Ashley home. If you have any information, even the smallest detail, contact the police. Your assistance could make all the distance. This is horrible. I hope you find her. Best tab to look at the shopping list. Canned food, snacks, soda, milk, cereal, wine. Okay, so we got to go and buy something. Yeah, right. Soda. Not that soda. Okay, so what have we got first? Canned food. How do we collect it? That seems to be ending up. Can't talk to you. What's this guy? Look, oh, stranger. Oh, hi there. I haven't seen you in here before. Are you new? Yes, I've just moved in. Where do you live? I don't feel comfortable telling you that. Are you alone? Uh, I'm in a hurry. Sorry, I've got to go. Right, we need to check off our shopping list then. Canned food, snacks and soda. There's loads of canned food, snacks and soda, but we can't seem to pick anything up. What about that one's up the top? There we go. We got the organic food. We need snacks, crisps. Oh, they've got little handles above them. Uh, soda. Doors just open. These left. Milk. Uh, you'd think this would be in a fridge, but obviously it's not. Here it is. Cereal. There was only one car outside, right? And he's just got in it. He's just got in it. So wine. There we go. That's all. Let's go and pay. Hello, is that all? Yes. All right, the total is $22.50. Thank you for shopping here. Also, I can tell you're new to the area. How long are you staying for? No problem. I'm not sure yet. Not too long, I'd assume. All right, have a good day. And there's your groceries. Thanks, you too. Oh, there's loads of cars here now. Wait, ours was that red one. <laughs> God, you know, a young beautiful lady like you shouldn't be out all alone like this. What do you want? I have some strange wishes, but I think it's best they remain unspoken. Be careful and don't let me catch you all alone again. I don't need your warnings. Please respect my space and stay away. Scared the shit out of me. What is it with the fellas in this game? They're all nuts. Right, it's dark. Let's not forget the groceries in the car. Right. Need to check. The door is still locked. Let's get in while we can. Right, that's locked. It's still locked. Right, we need... Uh, no, no, we need lights. Kitchen was which way? Which way was the kitchen? This side. Where's the light switch? There we go. Right, we put the stuff away. We got our phone out. Don't need the torch, do we? We'll keep it on just in case. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Oh, no. Welcome home. We've got to go outside. You look beautiful in the store today. Oh, who's that guy? Can't wait to see you again. That door won't budge. Good. Good. Getting closer. What's getting closer? Uh oh. Is he inside or outside? I think he's outside. I'm soon there. I mean, it sounded like he was upstairs, right? 
What if I'm already there? It sounded like he was upstairs, but the breaker room was outside. I don't want to unlock the door in case... This is creepy. This is so creepy. He's just knocked at the door. He's just knocked on the door. Says, I'm there. But he's not there. He's gonna be behind me, isn't he? He's gonna be behind me. If this one doesn't have a peephole in it. Oh, we've left the fridge open. I know it's a weird thing to worry about right now, but... He can't be inside, right? He can't be inside. We're gonna die. We're gonna die. We're gonna get murdered in our sleep. Are we just stay in here? Lock the door? We've checked our bedroom. The only room that we haven't checked is that one. I don't know whether we already checked uh, if we shut that door behind us. Right, we've been round the whole house. We've been round the whole house and he's not inside. Is this what? Check the door. Check the door. We did check the door. Open it. Have we got to open it? We're going to have to go to the breaker room around the back. Turn the, light, the power back on. And we've left the front door open. He's going to be inside when we go back. We are so stupid. I think it's best I don't press any buttons here. But how are we going to turn the power back on? This is so bad. We should just lock him in the house and get in the car and go. Because I know he's going to be inside now. I know it. Oh, there's another letter. Dear this new resident, congratulations on settling in. You may believe this mansion is your refuge, but every step you take reveals a deeper game. And with you in every choice, every move, there's no escape from becoming mine. This is getting out of hand, I need to drive away and call the police before it's too late. Don't be behind me when I turn around. <laughs> Don't be in the car either. Don't be in the car either. Lock the door when you get in. Don't be stupid. Not now. Start, start. <gasps> This is bad. Please start come up why now of all times. I'm sweating. I'm literally sweating here. Something's really wrong. I have to get inside and call the cops like right now. But we know. We know he's going to be in there. We got no power. Press F to call the police. Watch an emergency. Help, I need help. I've been receiving threatening messages, let letters and texts. I'm really scared. I'm here to help you. Can you please provide your location? I'm at the mansion. <laughs> it's urgent. I understand I'm dispatching officers to your location right away. Can you describe the nature of the threats? They've been watching me, following me. The messages are getting more intense. Please hurry. Stay on the line with me. Help is on the way. In the meantime, try and find a safe space and secure location within your home. And make sure you lock doors and officers. Uh, the officers should be there soon. Yes, they're locked. Please hurry. Help is on the way. Stay strong. I'm with you until the officers arrive. Someone's just tried to open the door. Officers will be there any second now. They're here. They're here. 
I see him, though. Did he get a knock? It appears everything's under control. Our officers have apprehended a man in a white van outside your residence. <sighs> We're bringing him in for questioning. If something else happens, don't hesitate to call us. Take care. Oh, I didn't mean to press that. Thank you for your help. I'll be sure to reach out if something else happens. That's not the right guy, is it? It's not the right guy. You were a relief. I never thought I'd feel safe again, but maybe things can get back to normal now. Should be safe now. Let's head to the basement outside and restore the power. Yeah. <laughs> We've been there already. Uh, I don't want to do this. I don't want to do this. So creepy. So creepy. We've been going like 20 minutes, right? And... I've been on edge the whole time. Ever since that fellow was in the apartments at the start. Uh oh. Did you hear that? The power should be back on now. Go back inside. Oh, <laughs> it's not it's not nice. It's not nice. We could have locked it and came back in that way, but we didn't we were soft, we didn't lock the front door. Hear the music. I stink of sweat. Let's take a bath before I go to sleep. Right, the bathroom is in here, right? Shut the door, turn the lights on. Run the bath. Oh. My arms feel dead heavy. <laughs> she needs to hurry up. Finally, a moment of peace. Chills. Got chills. But why would the stranger go that far for me? Whatever. It's over now. Someone just took a photo. I'm so exhausted. Many things now. Let's just go to bed. I definitely heard a camera take a photo. Yeah, I bet you it's on our phone. I bet you. <laughs> right. Whoever took a photo, right? And. Um. Can't get my words out. Whoever took the photo couldn't see us because the door was shut. But we gotta go to bed anyway. Get some sleep. If you heard that right, you check every inch of the house. Did you hear that? It sounded like a door rattled. Just go asleep. <laughs> Just go asleep. <laughs> Damn, we're gonna wake up in the morning. Someone's on the stairs. What's that noise? It's still the night time. What time is it? There's a light outside. Sounds like it's coming from the storage room. Oh, that's that one right underneath us. There was a light shining outside though. Just a nightmare. <laughs> it's gonna give me nightmares. Fuck. <sighs> I should probably call to check how Liam is doing. I mean, the reason all this is happening. He's the reason all. I mean, I can't even read now. <laughs> I should. <laughs> I should probably check. I should probably call to check how Liam is doing. I mean, the reason all this is happening to begin with is because I broke up with him. It's all my fault. If I'd have just stayed with Liam, it'd have kept me safe. Yeah. Let's not call him. No, of course not. What am I thinking? Let's put my mind to something else. But first, let's make sure the house is empty. I still don't feel safe. You don't feel safe? I think I just made a mess in, me, in the room.
Was it a dream? Was it a dream? Right, we're going to check all the rooms. Start with the bathroom. No one in here. Start with this creepy room. Next. I thought there was a letter or something then. Something looks off about that book space. History of art. Oh, we got a secret room. <gasps> we got a secret room. What's this? Look, honey, we made the news. Pretty cool, right? Oh, hang on, we might be able to send it over. No, we can't. Rural news, a sudden disappearance. Ashley's whereabouts unknown. 27-year-old Ashley was reported missing on August the 15th, 2013 by her husband. Two days after she disappeared from their home. That's this house, right? Um, last seen in their residence, Ashley's sudden absence has raised suspicions with her husband emerging as a prime person of interest in the ongoing investigation. While authorities continue to search for leads, they urge anyone with information to come forward and assist in a search for Ashley. Where was she last seen? Right, we got another piece of paper there. Why would you want to leave me? I've done nothing. I've done nothing but be good to you. Whatever, it doesn't matter anymore. You're never leaving me again now. Okay, so what? Oh! Yeah, let's shut that and make it look like we've never been in here. We can't close it. We can't close it. The way people run at you in this game is horrendous. It's outside looking empty, you know. Like, did we miss something in there? Because it's still not um, a hatch. It's locked. Oh, there's pictures, pieces of paper on the wall. I can't replace you, Ashley. There's no one that is as special as you. Why did you force me to do this? I never wanted to harm you. My fault? How is it my fault? How is it my fault? I didn't want it to end like this. You left me with no other options. What the fuck did I just do? How am I going to live without you? What's the point of all this? I'm typing to a dead person. I'd do anything to get you back. Am I dreaming? I swear that you. She looks just like you. Have you come back to me ten years later? <gasps> She's just as beautiful as you are. She has to come. She has to be mine. She has to become mine. She will, no matter what. I can't let her run away from me like you once did. Oh no. It's probably about time to talk to Grandpa about what's going on here. This is crazy. We can't turn round. And the room went red. Grandpa, are you there? Yes, has something happened? A lot has been happening. I've received creepy letters and been followed by someone. I don't think it's Liam. I called the police and they arrested the suspicious, suspicious individual lurking around the house. But when I thought it was all over, I found a strange hidden room in your house that contains some psychotic things, to say the least. What? That's insane. Maybe the police arrested the guy, leaving the letters and a hidden room? I've lived there for 10 years and I've never seen that. I'll be cutting this business trip short and coming home as soon as possible. I can't stand not being able to help you. I'd like to think they arrested him, but what if they didn't? What if he's still out there? What if they arrested someone who got set up? It makes me so uneasy just thinking about it. What do you remember about the person you brought, bought this place from? That could definitely be the case. I remember his wife had recently gone missing without a trace. He was the talk at the town for quite a while. And his name was... Uh oh Oh, my phone's ran out of battery and I didn't have time to bring a charger with me. Well, this is where it goes downhill, right? Let's go and find a flashlight in case I need one. I think I remember seeing one in the basement. We've got to go back outside. Jack the peephole. Not in there. Why would you not have a way to the basement? The creepy noise stopped when we come outside. Why would you why would you not have a way to the basement from inside the house? Why would you have to come all the way around the back? Makes no sense. And why don't we lock the doors to it? Right, there's the flashlight. Press F to turn on the flashlight. That's probably a bit better than our phone, right? <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> God's sake, this game. What was that? 
I turned away. I turned away. I don't. E oh, that just made. Did that just go in? It flashed up again. Don't want to be here. Don't want to be here. Okay, let's get inside. Lock the door. I should search for a weapon just in case. Let's start looking through Grandpa's office upstairs. Okay. You there? You there? We're going to walk in, right? And Grandpa's going to be sat in here at some point. Right, I'm not seeing any weapons in his office. Oh, we can go in the drawers. Not in them. It is a letter. Oh, I wanted to read that. Has he got crisps in there? Not enough use in here. Oh, so we can't take the letter then. It's going to be a secret room, isn't it? There's going to be a secret room somewhere. It's got to be Grandpa, right? We never found a weapon. I'm not going to shit myself again. I'm not going to shit myself again. <laughs> uh oh. Sorry if I scared you, I just had to come clean about something. Of course you did. Are you the creeper that talked to me earlier outside the convenience store? What do you want to come clean about? I know it was creepy, but it wasn't my idea. Liam told me to do it in the hopes that you'd take him back to feel safe again. I was supposed to take it a step further. No, but I couldn't do it. I felt sorry for you. It all makes a lot more sense now. Thank you for telling me. I still don't feel safe around you. Can you leave now, please? Yes, of course. I'm sorry again now. So, Liam had someone follow us here. He's driving away. He's driving away. We can't see him go. We can't see him going any further. Definitely locked that, right? And I want to make sure this one is locked as well. Right, really? It's a night already. Let's get some bed. Some bed. Let's get to bed. Go sleep. I thought there was a light outside before, right? But... It must just be reflections. Must just be reflections. Night sleep time. I think I'd be sleeping with the lights on if it was like this. Uh oh. I come from the bedroom door. <gasps> you thought this was over. You feel helpless now, don't you? Your car doesn't work. Your phone is dead. The police think they got the person behind this and you don't know where I am. There's nothing, there's nothing that can stop me anymore. Oh, what did I do? I know if I follow down the other path or so when I first got here, maybe I can find some neighbours that can help me. Oh, you are messing. You are messing. We've got to go out. Shit, 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 shit. Run. Run, run, run. We're dead slow. <laughs> We're so slow. I don't even know where we're going. I don't know which the other path was because I don't know which one we came down. I wasn't watching. I just heard something behind us rustling in the bushes. Grandpa's going to come back and get killed. He is. <laughs> There's the other guy's car. Can we get in it? It's definitely Liam's car. I'm stuck. Okay, now the road has ended and I'm lost. This way? No. Because I just seen something move up there. Oh, there's a door. What the hell is this place? There's a tunnel. Were we meant to find this? Were we meant to find it? No, we haven't found a weapon still. I just heard someone coughing or laughing or something. There's a light down here. Some blood. <gasps> Who's that? That's Liam. What happens to you? Why would someone do this to you? She is mine. No way. No way someone took that photo. And only mine. Oh, God. So Liam's dead. We should have rang him. Chef sh press shift to sprint. 
we were pressing shift to sprint. That means we've got to escape, doesn't it? Oh, there's a coffin. Someone's bones, flowers. I think these are actually remains what a sick, twisted individual her husband is. I don't even want to know what he'd do to me. There's that thing. There's that thing to the, that room. But we can't get up there. Right, I need to have another quick look over here, just see if we missed anything. No. How are we going to get out? I know someone's going to be in the way. Oh, shit. Kashia, hey, I couldn't wait anymore. I need you now, my new Ashley. Oh, she was, he was the husband. So it was you who's been sending the letters. I know it looks similar to your ex-wife, but that doesn't mean I can replace her. I don't care. How you look is more than enough. Come here, I've been waiting so long for this. No, I have to run before it's too late. Run. Run, run, run. <laughs> oh, he's going to catch us. He's going to catch us. Oh, there's police here. There's police here. We need to get out before they, they go away. I thought it was locked then. Oh, was that the police? I hope so. <laughs> police arrived on the scene just in time, thanks to Grandpa. Yuri back home after the abrupt ending to Kate's phone call with him. When he arrived home, he realised that Kate was nowhere to be seen. He got a sink and go feeling that the worst might have happened. He called the police instantly and they made it just in time. The relief Grandpa felt after the news was like nothing else. What happened to everyone else involved? The man in the white van said it was his reason, reasoning for being outside Kate's home was because he saw a stranger following her home from the store. Of course, the police didn't believe him when they saw no one else was there. But when the news broke free about this, the police realised their mistake and that he had actually been telling the truth. He was released the same day. Liam's accomplice was never seen again after the incident. The psychopath who killed his ex-wife, Ashley, Liam and almost Kate ended up getting sentenced to life in prison. Kate is doing her best to recover from the incident. But it's difficult. At night, she often hears those daunting knocks on her bedroom door, disrupting her attempts to sleep. Throughout every day, she finds herself checking behind and scanning every corner, consumed by fear and paranoia. Thanks for playing. You know what? That was good. What a game made by solo developer Ovenrula. Ovenrula. You know what? That was good. That was good. It was scary it was jumpy as hell but the story was kind of good as well but that is where we are going to finish off everyone thank you so much for watching really does mean a lot hope you have enjoyed the episode hope you're enjoying the videos that we're playing on the channel at the minute if you are new here if you are enjoying it please hit that subscribe button if you enjoyed the episodes hit the thumbs up and drop some comments down below really does help out loads I want to say a massive thank you to all the people who signed up on the patreon and joined as members it really does mean a lot thank you so much and we will see you in the next one thanks everyone bye